Hi. So it's not uncommon to find that some children at some point in their life may be badly behaved. Now, as a parent, a teacher, or a guardian, it doesn't mean that this child is totally unsalvageable. What it means is that it is a phase of their life that you have to handle properly. Now, in situations where they hit other children or throw unnecessary tantrums, what do you do? Do you throw them away? Do you hit them? Do you ignore or you scream your lungs out? Now, whatever your answer was, does it matter? We are here to learn. Now, the first thing you can do when you notice that a child is badly behaved is to be calm. Do not overreact because sometimes we tend to overreact and then we worsen the situation. So instead of, instead of aggravating the situation, just be calm and avoid overreacting. Okay, the second thing you can do is to ensure that the child is not on a spectrum. It is important that you check out the child, make sure the child is not on a spectrum. And once you've cleared that out of the way, the third thing you can do is to talk to the child. A lot of persons actually think that children are not adults, so they don't have opinions. But really, a child is a human being like an adult, so he or she can actually be talked to and the child can reason with you. So the third thing you can do is to actually talk to the child and ensure that the child understands what he or she has done wrong and why you do not want that kind of behavior. The fourth thing you can do is to make sure you encourage good behavior. You don't have to encourage it anything big as such. You could actually encourage good behavior and praise him or her for good behavior in instances where there's a portrayal of good behavior. You can give the child a hug, a high five, or even a handshake, something little that the child can appreciate to know that, oh, I actually appreciate what you just did. So it's important that we put these things into perspective. And the fifth thing we can also do is to make sure we are showing good example to these children. Be a role model to your child. Don't expect the child to behave well when you're not properly behaved. Watch my other video for the next tips.